Another app worth noting is the eShare server. This provides us with a URL address which we can either QR code or type into the browser of a tablet, be it Android or iPad, which will then download an app to the tablet itself. If I then take the tablet and run that complementary app, and then, for example, choose to mirror the TV, I've now got that display duplicated onto my tablet. On the board, I'm just going to press the Home key. So, for example, controlling from the tablet, the pointer is moving on our main screen, I can go into Clevernote, and I can do an activity from here. And then I can choose to exit from that. Uh, I won't save in this instance. And if I go back, equally I can take an object such as an image that's just on this tablet and I can send that out to the Clever Touch. And of course, once it's there, I can call up the widget and annotate directly on the image. I can come out of that. And if there were other um, files, such as audio, like this over the horizon, that in turn is being sent out to the Clever Touch Plus. So I can then exit out of the app here or just press the home key and we're back to the beginning again. Again in apps and using the eShare server and doing a similar path of following the QR or the IP address onto a laptop which has the technical ability to do a, a mirror cast. We download the eShare client and when we run that client and then start mirroring. Our laptop display appears up on the Clever Touch Plus. And if we do some other activity here, such as opening up a PDF document and then just working this remotely. So our display is mirrored from our laptop wirelessly up to the Clever Touch. And once again, we can use our annotation widget on the Clever Touch Plus. And then we will stop the mirroring and go back home. Back on our home screen, I can press the menu button or equally just draw up from the bottom. You can see our two video sources. We're currently working on the Android. There is a connector into the HDMI one. So if I now choose that, we now have a replica display from our attached laptop. The additional connection here is that we also have a USB cable. So not only are we looking at the laptop, but we have control via the Clever Touch Plus of the contents of the laptop itself. So for example, if I take an application like Lynx, so Clever Lynx opens up, and any work that I do on the laptop, I can now do here. So for example, if I go to File, and I choose a sample file, and off we go. I'm not going to go through the entire features of this interactive whiteboard software, but just some very basic things. We might do a presentation screen. We might choose to use, for example, the spotlight tool on top of that presentation. So as we go around, we can talk about the different parts. And when we're finished, we right click as in long press. And from the menu that appears, we can exit. Going to our next slide, here we can use the fill tool 
So if I use the fill, and let's say we go with the Uroshta, and so on, on our next slide, this is a simple drag and drop activity. So back into pointer mode, identify the color, drag away the label. And when we're finished, we just say file, and we can save that file, and then links itself, we can choose to quit. Do you want to save the changes? I would say no in this case. So complete control of any programs running on your laptop from the comfort of the Clever Touch Plus. Toomey Audiovisual have been supplying Irish schools with audiovisual equipment for 50 years. In that time, we have built a reputation for quality, service and backup support which is unparalleled. When you are considering investing in AV and ICT equipment for your school, it is worth considering the proven track record of your supplier within the industry. Call us on 01-466-0515 or visit www.tumiav.ie for a superior level of service.